The Netherlands has issued a license to export 24 F-16 fighter jets to Ukraine. Dutch Defense Minister Kaisa Ollengren announced this in a letter to the country's parliament, writes AD. According to journalists, the letter was also written on behalf of Foreign Minister Henk Bruin Slot and Foreign Trade Minister Lissier Skramacher. AD, citing sources in The Hague, also writes that the government wanted to issue a license as soon as possible, before a new cabinet came to power. At the same time, the coalition parties, the publication notes, agreed to continue to politically, militarily, financially and morally support Ukraine. With the issuance of a license, AD writes, now nothing can prevent the supply of F-16s to Ukraine. So, the Netherlands has finalized export licenses for the fleet of F-16 fighter jets that will be delivered to Ukraine. Dutch Defense Minister Kaisa Ollengren did not disclose the exact date or other delivery details, citing operational security concerns. The announcement confirmed that export licenses for the aircraft had been issued. Ollengren told the media in June that the Dutch F-16s would reach Ukraine at some point in the summer. Previous projections were more pessimistic, suggesting a fall delivery date. According to her, Ukraine can use its F-16s to target military objectives on Russian territory, with the condition that international humanitarian law is observed. The jets will arrive a year after Denmark and the Netherlands co-founded the Fighter Jet Coalition for Ukraine at the NATO summit in Vilnius in July 2023. President Volodymyr Zelensky said that Ukraine expects to expand and strengthen its air defense capacities in the coming month. The first fighters are expected to arrive in the summer. In addition to the Netherlands, Denmark, Belgium and Norway also promised to supply aircraft to Ukraine. A missile attack has been launched on Crimea and Sevastopol city in the peninsula, local telegram channels reported. The strikes were reportedly carried out by the Ukrainian army with the use of storm shadow missiles on the Balaklavsky thermal power plant and the territory of the military unit. As a result, an explosion and fire occurred. The governor of Sevastopol, Mikhail Razvozaev, said that the air defense system was activated and five missiles were shot down. He also said that several cars were damaged during the attack. No casualties have been reported so far. Блять, склад какой-то. Там же воинская часть, нахуй. Вон, огоньки всякие. Вон взрыв. Прям, ого, бабахнуло, смотри. Вот это, блядь, вот это да нахуй. 
Да, Димочка, блядь, ты на, на нормальном месте, блядь, купил, блядь, дом, участок. Вот только дошел звук. Нихуя себе. Ценный кадр. Охуетительно. Блять, склад какой-то. Там же воинская часть, нахуй.